baby, I've been slipping back, heading south Car sick on a Tuesday, missing cash, blacking out Heartless in a few ways, shit for luck, elbow shredded, I help Hello everyone, Fear Marcel here today And right now I'm doing something completely different from what I usually do on my YouTube channel I'm doing a uh, Sony Vegas tutorial. I was thinking about I should start doing tutorials on Sony Vegas. I have stuff I know how to do and everything. So this video is going to kick off, I want to say, a, a series of me doing tutorials on my channel. And to start it off, I'm, I'm going to do the CC lens effect. It's a, like a warpy ripple effect on Sony Vegas. It's really easy to do and uh, let me get right into it. So what you want to do is you want to start off by making two video tracks on Sony Vegas and you want to upload a uh, file a video file or um, whatever you want the ripple effect to be on so I'm just going to just choose a random picture for this effect I have a thing of pool balls and then next you want to go into media generators and you want to choose the uh, elliptical ring in the color gradient section just throw that on and I already have presets set for this and um, I named them CC down here and uh, right here on this uh, tab um, on this view it's it shows that it's kind of like an oval and everything but if you come over here to the video preview it's not an oval so that's good um, if you want to you could copy down my uh, settings I have for uh, this elliptical I have my ratio at 59.9 my distance at 0.1 and uh, you just uh, mess around with it and make it how you, you uh, how it's suitable for you. And um, after that, I'm I'm just going to just going to shorten this. Shorten this. To, yeah, three seconds is good. Next, you want to uh, go to custom, and then you want to add in a Sony hype map. Hit add, and then hit hit OK, and then this will pop up. And again, I already have uh, some presets set for this. And uh, if I just reload. Oops. Here go uh, my presets I have. I have my amplitude to 0 0.1, my evolution to 0 0.098. My high scale is set to 0 0.9. And if I click over here, you can kind of see the effect already happening. Um, it's trans the, the elliptical ring is uh, transparent. I'm gonna smooth this on 19 and uh, this this is kind of important to have your edge pixel handling uh, wrap pixel around instead of a transparent background. So um, basically that's basically the, uh, the effect and everything. We'll just do one more thing. And if we go to uh, view and pan crop, uh, event pan crop, I mean, and we start over at the first keyframe of, of the uh, elliptical. We want to zoom out. We want to zoom out and make sure that these two boxes are checked. And um, you just want to zoom all the way out until the circle is very, very small on the uh, video preview. That's that's about good. And then you want to go to the very last keyframe and I'll just make sure that this, yep. Go to the very last keyframe and then you're just going to zoom back in until uh, the effect, oops, till the effect is uh, completely wrapped away. And now if I, uh, now if I um, render this out, pre-render this by hitting uh, Shift B. You can see the effect happen. You'll just have to play with it, but that's basically how you do it. And um, yeah, I was asked a lot on that video that I showed you in the beginning about how I did that effect. And this is how you do it. Thank you guys for watching. And if you guys want to see more Sony Vegas tutorials on my channel, please make sure you leave a like and comment down below. And I uh, thank you guys.